Yo, what is going on guys? It is midnight and today we are bringing you yet again another video. Now, I'm going to start by saying yesterday you did not receive a video. I think, yeah, yesterday. So, the reason why that is is because now I should be going back to work soon. So, I don't have as much time available as I would like. Um, not only that, but there isn't any content there's not too much content to get into I've gone through pretty much all the guides that you would need to know to get started and to kind of keep you going steadily throughout the game so there aren't too many guides that I can actually give you anymore obviously there'll be like stuff like character reviews what relics are good for what characters are what four stars three stars yada 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 all of that stuff that will still come as well as obviously all the events and the most popular summoning videos and upcoming unit videos a lot of you guys tend to like that, they're the most successful videos on the channel, so of course they will not be going anywhere. This just means that I am most likely going to be uploading either two to three times a week, maybe three, four times a week, something like that. Between two to four videos a week, depending on how much time I have, because, yeah, work, content, and obviously, if there's loads of events coming out, so like next... When is it? Next year? Well, whenever the 22nd is, that's apparently a new banner and a new event. So that day, there'll be like three or four videos coming out just on that time alone, just because of the events. However, this week, it'll be like something like this video now, which is going to be going through the new event. Obviously, it's not out yet. It comes out tomorrow or in set amount of hours from now. However, it is good to kind of give you a rough idea of what you're walking into and what you're going to be going through. Now, I'll come back to a few other channel updates towards the end of the video because quite a lot has actually happened. Um, but for now, let's just jump in the video because that's probably what you're here for. So let's just go straight into it. So tomorrow we have got a new event. Once again, they're bringing out content like it's no man's land. Literally all the time we're getting content, which is pretty good and pretty bad at the same time. Good because you can get free stones and it keeps people active bad because for example this event not many people are going to be able to do so let's have a little look at it so this is a chaos field event now the way this will work is they'll be kind of similar to the other event let's just quickly show you what it's like so kind of similar to this event here the Khan village event you will have a range of like missions to go through kind of like this there probably won't be as many I'm not sure off the top of my head how many you'll get but I can assume you'll get slightly over, if not, depending on how far you can do, around about 500 gems, you'll get something like that. You'll get quite a lot, which is good. But yeah, it is gonna be a very, very hard event. Like, even for myself. So there's one person I think, at the moment I've seen, that I think can personally actually do every single mission free star. There is another guy, the one that I done a summoning video against yesterday, Katome, or Katomi, however you pronounce your name, buddy. <laughs> he's he's got a good chance of doing it as well. Um, if I can get my two new units leveled up, I can try. Basically, this event will be single plow. It will be a coin shop event, so you'll get coins from the event, and you can buy stuff in there like materials, also unit, which I'll talk about in a second. You can get loads of stuff from the shop. Um, there's the only thing that it, this mission is different compared to the other one besides in fact it's solo is this one will have a ranking event or it did in JP at least so I can only assume that it will come back again but don't quote me on this because they've been doing loads of stuff different on um, global but yeah it'll be like this sort of coin shop here so yeah there is a ranking event the rewards on the ranking event are not worth going for you'll get like gold uh, the leveling up stones relic items tickets you just get that sort of stuff there's not anything that stands out, not really anything that jumps out. Like first place just gets like 2 million gold, I think, something like that. So yeah, it's not worth going for top rank on this ranking event. It will only last a week and on this event you will have, towards the end, you'll start doing level 90 and above missions. The last one being level 100 mission. Now, I'm going to warn you now. Do not feel down if you cannot do this event. This is literally testing you. This is where it's probably going to bring out all the best players in the game, see how far they can get. Um, as I said, I don't even think I'm going to be able to do like the last mission. I'll probably be able to do the 90 missions, but the level 100 mission I don't think I'll be able to do. Um, at least not when the event first comes out. I'm going to try my best to try and do it so that I can kind of upload that video and you guys can see what it's like to complete that 100 mission. 
If not, I can try and ask one of the Discord members that I believe can do it, see if he's done it, and if he has, then I'll ask him to see if he can record it for me so that I can kind of commentate over it. Because it is quite difficult to do. Sorry if I got really loud there. It is gonna be very difficult to do. I mean, there's literally, there's like a 95% chance you will be able to do it without Mare, and there is like a 100% chance you will not be able to do it with, um, you won't be able to do it without Irons and without Mare. Like, you need at least one of them, preferably both. Like, I don't understand how you're gonna be able to do it without Mare. Um, the last boss at the end, he's basically immune to everything. You can only just deal damage to him whilst he just slaughtered you. You need a healer. So yeah, it is gonna be a very tough event indeed. Um, from the event, you'll get points as well. So kind of similar to the current event, you'll get like leveling up points where when you meet a certain criteria, you'll be able to get rewards. In this case, rather than it being a relic, you'll get a four star Yuri um, unit, which is a speed type. Now, a lot of people are thinking this is another 100 luck unit, it is not. So this unit here, I, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to quickly host a mission because I'm not going to really show you any gameplay otherwise. So this mission is, let's see. Uh, you don't get 100 luck on this unit. So the only thing that you can get from here is one Yuri from the event. And I think it's four or five from the shop. In total, you can get her 25 or 20 luck, something like that. Um, not a bad unit, I mean, over time you'll be able to get her max luck because when this event comes out again and again and again, you'll be able to buy this unit again and again. But first time round, you won't be able to 100 luck this unit. So yeah, I would not feel down either. Hamsuk's still gonna be the meta right now for farming stuff. But yeah, that is pretty much everything. The mission is gonna be insanely hard. There's loads of missions that are gonna be above level 70, 80, 90. Um, there's that level 100 mission. I'm not sure what the reward is. I'm assuming it'll be gems, but it could also be an achievement title, which would be very cool. Obviously, you'd have to be able to freestar it, which means no continues, no deaths. <laughs> Excuse me, and completing it. So, yeah, it's going to be very difficult to do without Mare, as you can tell. Now, speaking of Mare, I broke, well, I didn't break a rule, but I did, I, um, I definitely done something pretty bad, though, which would have been smart if I recorded it. I ended up doing, because I know what the next banner is, which is Neurologist, or how we pronounce it, the little squid thing in the anime. Uh, because I know it's that, coming out on the 22nd, I, I'm not too keen on summoning for that video. Obviously, I'm going to summon for you guys, but be, I say this every video, it's literally going to be a thousand. I swear to God, it'll be a thousand. Touch wood, okay? It might be 1,500, but... We'll, we'll stick at 1,000. So I don't, I'm not too fussed if I get this unit. So with the gems I had, I decided, cool, I'm missing a few units. I'm going to do a few multis. I think I've done three or maybe four multis on um, the Pandora banner off camera. So that's about 1,500, 2,000 gems. I ended up pulling, as you may or may not have just seen in the video, Irons, the regular one, which is one that I needed. I ended up pulling another Mighty Warrior Relic, a Shaltir, which was new for me. A Sebus and another Shouty move. And I believe that is it. So we fall. Then this morning on reset. So at this moment in time, I need Narbaral 4 star, which isn't too much of an issue. Pandora and Mare. They're the only three units I need in the game. I've got all the two, three, all the rest of the four, and all the rest of the five star units. I need one relic that is five star. Otherwise, I've had everything in the game. Besides for one relic and three units. I've done the daily <coughs> free to play summons, um, which cost 30 gems. And i done that and I ended up getting Mare. So there we go. I'm basically set for the event. And coming to that, that is pretty much everything. Yeah, nothing good there. So I'm in the works of trying to level up those two units, which is going to take a load of time and is very difficult to do. Um, especially since the abyss quests are changing every so often and not daily so i'm gonna farm this event here let's get away from my potions you don't want to see that <laughs> but yeah that is pretty much everything so last thing i will say is daily content probably won't happen anymore as of tomorrow well i kind of tested it out yesterday see like what it'd be like um so it'll probably be two to four videos a day 
uh, a week, sorry, not a day, Jesus. Two to four videos a week, depending on the situation. Discord server has just reached over a thousand members. I think we're on like a thousand forty, thousand fifty, something like that. So if you want to join the Discord, then feel free to. We've already hit one milestone. Why not hit another? And subscribers, I'm on like 650 soon, soon to come, hopefully. So yeah, um, the sooner I can get to a thousand, the sooner I'll be able to start live streaming, which are, a few of you are asking me to do, which I can't do until I hit a thousand subs. So yeah, guys, that is everything. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And tomorrow, I will probably upload a video tomorrow of the event, if not the next day, which will be Tuesday. Probably be tomorrow, to be honest. Um, and then I'll try and build my way up and try and see if I can do the last mission by the end of the week. If not, I would ask someone if I can get like a footage of them doing it so that you guys can see what it's like but i won't take any credit because obviously i'm not the one doing it but guys hopefully you enjoyed the video take care and peace out